Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy 3. We just defeated Hein, and we're probably gonna go to the New World soon, so that's exciting. Let's just get started. Okay, so I know the first thing we have to do is head north to the castle to talk to Argus, so um, I'm gonna slowly make my way there. First, I gotta get to my ship, and then after that, I have to actually go up there. I'm also gonna stop in Tokol. I just wanna see, you saved us, thank you. I wanna see, is there anything I can do here? What about maybe talk to Sid? Oh, Sid isn't here. Sid is at the other place, right? He's in Canaan. Let's go inside. And do not worry about Argus, Warriors of the Light. We will restore the kingdom with our own hands. Where there is hope, there is a way. And we did get most of the items, like the secret items in here already. So, um, there's not... Yeah, as I said, we got these items, right? Yeah, so, um... We don't need to grab those. We could probably just go straight to Argus and talk to him then. Thank you, young ones. Your brave actions have brought peace to our kingdom once again. Here, take this with you. It is the Argus family heirloom, the Wheel of Time, a box created by the powerful ancients. Bring it to Sid and Kanan. This must be what Sid needs to build another airship. We'll be able to go to the surface world. So you have already met Sid. Then you know what you must do. Go forth, warriors of light. Okay. So now we'll be able to get a flying ship, which is nice. Okay. Then, to the town of... Canaan? I think that's where we left him. But I can't remember, but I think that's where we left him, so... Um, let's see, how do we... It's right here, so... Honestly, we could go all the way around. But we have to town, so I think. This house... Wait, is this Canaan? Oh, we went to the wrong place. Ah, uh, that's frustrating. We went to the wrong place, right? This is not Canaan, this is... Okay, well, well, here, um, this is Johnny, but... Alright, dude, this is like super embarrassing. We're at the wrong town again. Kanan is over here. Dude, I cannot get this right. Question, can I even get over there? Oh, it's right here. Okay, perfect. I was gonna say, man, like, dude, I visited like three towns. Like, this is like to the point where it's a little embarrassing, so I'll have to get some later. Okay, this should be it. Kanan! Yes, there we go. Exactly what I was looking for here. So his house is not this one, but let's just, I guess, nothing. I forgot these guys have mithril, so this was like earlier in the game. Is it yours, or is it more north? It's more north, okay. And I'm having location troubles today. All right, this is his house right here. The Wheel of Time, so you've met King Argus. All right then, it's time to get to work. I'll turn your Enterprise into a brand new airship. Yeet boop bop. It's done. Press E to turn it into an airship. Fair enough. Remember though, you can only land in water. It was a sea ship to begin with, you know. Now, we can finally get away from the floating continent and back to our own world. Our own world? What do you mean? I guess it's time you knew the truth. You four and I are not from this world, this floating continent. Ten years ago, I was flying my airship, filled with passengers. It seemed to be a day like any other, until... Suddenly, the airship was engulfed in an impenetrable darkness. The 
Next thing I knew, my airship was in pieces. We had crashed, and things were aflame everywhere I looked. The only survivors, aside from myself, were you four. You probably don't remember. You were only kitties then. I don't know what happened to our world after the darkness came, but y you must go and find out. You have been chosen as the Warriors of Light. I know you'll make it. Okay, so apparently we knew this guy from before all of this, so that's kind of cool. Alright, so we can officially now go to the underworld, but before we do that, give it a quick rest fairly soon, so. So, now we can turn into an airship, and I'm pretty sure if we just go to the edge of the map, of, like, an edge of any other part of the map, we can kind of just yeet off, right? Yeah. What is this cloud? It's draining my strength away. Hold on, our answers lie on the surface. We must reach it. I hope they reach the surface all right. Warriors of Light, you lads are our last hope. We're through. Is this the surface? It's so sprawling. Okay, do we get a map? Not really. Oh, so that's our floating continent right there. Okay, so we should probably head to one of those places there. Okay, um, let's go to that one Let's see what it is. Yeah, that's what it's like. Hold on, I'll see if there's... There's just the lands for a minute. Keep coming up here soon. Yes, right here. A broken ship. Okay, I can land in the... Okay. Let's see. Can I do anything with a broken ship? Wrecked ship. Is there gonna be, like, ghosts on here and stuff? that way there's a door there okay that way is blocked okay anything in these corners no blood sword okay Zeus's wrath there's people here Oh, oh, Miss Arya, are we ever in trouble? If nothing is done, our own time will cease as well. Gramps, calm down. Just what's going on? The land. Darkness has covered the land, and darkness has stopped our time. Miss Arya tried to stop it, but... Oh, me, oh my. Miss Arya, Miss Arya, wake up. She's very weak. We have to help her. I wonder if we have anything in our bag that can fix her up. We have an elixir. We have an elixir. It's the same one we gave to Sid's wife. Where's my elixir? There you go. Who are you? Where am I? The light. I see a powerful light within you. Could that be? I'm Luneth. The crystals guided us to this world. So you are the warriors of light. The crystals have chosen their champions. We are saved. If, if that were only true, time is still motionless outside of these walls. 
calls. So the world has succumbed to darkness. We have to save it. Bring me to the Temple of Water. Maybe if we bring the crystal shard there to the sealed crystal. Please, you must bring me to the Temple of Water. Okay. The Temple of Water it is. Okay. Please look after Masari. I will guard this place until you return. Okay. Fair enough. Real quick. Let's go to Ludith and we can replace the fleet um, with the blood. Absorbs life. Yes. There we go. That's what we needed. So we don't have the magic on the swords anymore, but swords are a lot stronger. So I'm not going to complain too much. And that one has life steal on it. So, you know, more than happy with that. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, let's get our sails going. Let's take her to the Temple of Water, which I'm just going to take a bright guess and say was that middle island that we visited with the temple in the cave. Spaceship, we are an airboat. Always gotta remember that. And I'm not gonna visit that cave just yet, so... Temple of Water. Ooh, I can heal here. Funny enough, um, I told you guys in the beginning of this playthrough, so I played this game years and years ago, so I don't have a very good memory of it. Funny enough, this is the one place that for some reason I have a pretty vivid memory of, which is really odd. Just the water temple, apparently. So I don't know what was in my brain at that time, but apparently this place stuck out to me. Thank the heavens, there's still light within this shard. I obtained Crystal Shard. So our next stop is the Sealed Water Crystal? Yes, it must be imbued with the Shard's light. Miss Arya, where did this Shard come from? Before the world was doomed, when we saw the darkness expanding, we priestesses sealed the crystal to protect it from the darkness, in the hopes that one day the war warriors of light would come. The shard was created to break the crystal seal. Come, we must go to the Cave of Tides to the north. Okay, so that is where we are going next to that cave. So, all of our MP and all that is good because we literally just visited the fountain, so we're probably pretty good to just uh, step in there. Oh, like always, though. I know we just saved like two minutes ago, but let me give us another save just so we don't have to go through all that again in case we die. Right, the Cave of Tides. Anything interesting in here? Let's see what type of enemies we encounter. Okay, I don't want to... Okay, they attack first? Are these guys like fast or something? Okay, so let's just... Attack, attack, we should probably save a lot of our stuff, but we'll put a cure on Re uh, Refia just because why not. And then I'm going to guess fire is probably good on these guys because we're in a water place. So I'm just going to take a bright guess here. If not, maybe I should try thunder to see if thunder is any better. But yeah, these guys don't look crazy strong, but they do do about like a hundred something damage, so about four hits would kill me. Luckily, Lunith has blood steel or life steel, so I'm gonna guard. And then, just because I'm curious, how much would a blizzard do? Oh, Arya's coming in. So that protect is really useful uh, for other than the fact that we're about to finish this battle, so. But, you know, hey, that's cool. Let's see how much the blizzard does. Okay, less. So, mm, I didn't, I don't have the level one form of the thunder, which is a little annoying, but. Yeah. Either way, if the boss is immune to thunder, we got the thundara, so. 
This is the sealed portal. It was created to keep outsiders away from the water crystal. Only priestesses of the temple may pass through. We may pass now. It's a long bridge. Counter. Okay. We're going to use I'm going to do a barrage, and then we just see what here on this, because I'm going to keep using fire against Okay. I'm pretty sure this is more of a linear dungeon, so I don't think there's much to find in this one. No, not many secrets. I think we just go and basically go to the end of it. Um, yeah, so... I'm not gonna grind here too much. I'm just gonna go to the boss and, um... Okay, really. Uh, let's use arrow. Let's use thunder. Just like everybody's defense was terrible. Just like, yeah. I just want to protect my boss. That was stupid. Okay, let's try this. Let's see his arrow. That's something, guys. Okay, that's not terrible. Okay, attack, attack, attack. And attack, attack. And attack, attack. And she was dead. That should have been dead. Yeah, I should have been dead. I don't have to waste, um, Phoenix down. But that was super close. Uh, oh no. I meant to go to magic. Mm, honestly, I might just use some potions here because we have them. There's no reason not to use them at this point, right? Oh, we got two bridges. Let's, let's go down this one first. Nothing here. Did we just get swindled? Okay, well, one more encounter because we got swindled, but that's alright. Let's go down a little bit. Okay, now we can heal that deep. Another encounter. All that. Now it's in just one. Okay. What's up here? Once again, the whole two bridge thing. Did it? Oh, there's probably a chest down there, right? I'm not gonna run around and get it, honestly. I'm. That's a little. I. I. These things are like a last. Stronger than I thought they would be, so I'm not gonna bother. Let's go up here, and before we hit another one, let's check his equipment. Already out of Medusa arrows. Okay, then I guess we put on some light arrows. We have a bunch of those, so. Was all of this for this chest? But it's for a Blazaga. That is some good stuff. I'm pretty sure. Who, who can. Oh, no, no, that, that we need that for our Black Mage. Level 4, learn Lazaga. Okay, that'll be a new spell we get to cast. But now I'm pretty sure we have to walk all the way around. Well, at least the one nice part of all this is we're getting plenty of experience, so honestly, not too bad. And I'm kind of glad we took that long route because we did get a Blizzara, which is probably pretty good for at least this, this, this stage. Is that a new enemy? What? How do we just now get this new enemy? At least these guys are like rare or something. That is kind of strong. Okay, well, we'll have to revive him, I guess. Okay, yeah, you just bit him for like 300 something of that. Especially since we'll probably want a lot of those cu big cures for Ark um, in the boss fight. Okay. It's a cool looking cave. 
Still have encounters. It's these things again, dude. I hate these things. Okay. Run all the way around. Okay, that's probably just the other side. I'll check that out after, maybe. Back attack. That's a little annoying. Boss room. Crystal of water, it is time for you to regain your light. Arya begins to pray, holding the shard out toward the crystal. Look, the crystal is regaining its light. It is now your turn. You must merge the light within you with the one within the crystal. Only then will the crystal regain its true light and banish the darkness from this world. Then time will flow once more. Look out. Aria, no. It seems luck is on your side today, warriors of light. Bro, what is that? I am Kraken, tasked by Lord Zande to steal the light from the crystal of water. And you, you are all about to die. Now I'm good, bro. Oh, he looks kind of sick, but he also looks really weird. No, don't auto battle. Don't auto battle. Okay. Well, I guess that's an obvious attack. What? Okay, he has some light arrows on him. Let's go ahead and switch those to something a bit stronger. Um, ice arrows? Let's use some... Maybe... Wait, but those wouldn't be strong, so I guess... Holy arrows it is. It's barrage. Magic. Let's use an arrow. And then let's use a blizzaga. I think that would be good here. How much damage does that do? That's a that's a good bit of damage. I'll have to be careful of that. Let's see, how much damage does he do? 300. How much does this do? 1,000. That's a good amount right there. Okay, so the bliz the blizzards was what we're gonna be using here. Okay. I guess we're just gonna attack. Wait, could I just use an Arctic Wind? Do I have any of those items? I don't think I do. Hmm. We could use one of these. I guess we might as well use it. Let's use magic. Let's use a cure on everyone. And of course, another Blizzaga because that does crazy. Don't kill. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? I did. I didn't have enough. I didn't have a chance to even heal before he did that. Well, at least we got this off. But Ark is still super low. If he gets hit, he's basically dead again. So that's not good at all. This does a ton of damage, but now we're almost screwed. So okay, we're gonna have to use a high potion. Where's my high potions? Elixir. Hmm. No, we'll save that. We don't need that. High potion. Let's give that to Ark. I guess we'll use a Phoenix down. And then I'm gonna just continue using Blizzagas because we kinda need to... We need to continue here. I am really hope he doesn't use Blizzard. Because that would basically kill both Ark and Ingus at the moment. So I need him to not do that. I need him to hit Lunith. Blind is also good. Because, yes, Lunith is amazing. He just jumped in and saved him. Okay, that's good. That's why we need Lunith here. That's why we need him here. Okay, we're going to attack with him. We're going to go ahead and heal ourselves up because he's fast, so he can do that. Okay, 
you need to be fast to heal yourself up. He is... What is he, blind? Can you still hit magic if you're blind? I think... Okay, with magic, we're gonna do another cure. We're gonna switch to all. And we're gonna use the last Blizzaga that we have. If things go really bad, I could maybe use an elixir on uh, Raffia and... You know, do four more Blizzagas. But I, she also has the level 3 blizzard, so that could also do a good bit of damage there. Alright. Blind. Okay. We're gonna have to unblind everyone with arc. Don't... Cure. Okay, that'll cure everyone a little bit, which is nice. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. I guess... Hmm, we just attack, right? There's nothing much we can do here. Probably... Oh, let's use a... Let's use another high potion on Ark. Make sure he doesn't die. With him... Wait, I don't have... I don't have a heal for blindness. But again, I guess we don't really need it. So I'm gonna go ahead and use another cure on everyone. And let's hope the Blizzara does a good bit of damage. Don't hit. That's good. Please hit someone who doesn't. Per that is exactly what I needed because Lunith has a crazy amount of uh, defense. So if he hits anyone, it needs to be Lunith, honestly. Okay, and then everyone gets healed. And then Lunith will even take some life, life steal back. Not too much, but, you know, it's something. He can get hit twice and still live. Okay, that only does about 600. I'm gonna need more than that, so... Mm. I need to unblind myself, but that's like a whole turn of doing nothing. Alright, let's just remove blind on me. Okay, what what is the strongest arrow we have right now? I guess Holy Arrows would still be our best option. Let's... Oh, no, no. With him, let's use the eye drops on... Actually, it doesn't matter if they're blind. They're not hitting, so... No, I will use a Barrage. With Magic, I'm gonna go ahead and cure everyone again. Make sure everyone's topped off. And then I guess I have no choice but to keep using Blazaras, right? Maybe if it gets down to it, I'll... I just hate using Elixirs, but... Honestly, I think using the elixir might be a very good idea. So we can get past that bump here. Okay, 300. Should do another good 600 here. He's he sh blind. Okay. Honestly, not even that big of a deal. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, that's that's fine. So I can now attack again. We can do another barrage. Let's go with another cure to everyone just to keep everyone topped off and uh, another Blizzard, I guess. That's about the only option we have. He should be very close to dead. That's the only reason I'm kind of going a little, you know, face first here. Cause I'm, yeah, because I was hoping he'd be close to dead. In that case, he was less than 200 HP, which is somewhat unlucky, but... All right, we got 5,000 gil. Arya. The crystal has regained its true light. Thank you. I... You must take this. The, the power of water. Arya has blessed you with the power of water. Arya, be strong. You can't leave us. No, it's too late for me. You must go. Promise me. Promise me you will banish the darkness and restore peace to the world. And she's dead. Feels bad. An earthquake. We have to get out of here. Watch out. Uh 
<laughs> That's a cool achievement. Release the Kraken. Ooh, the fog goes away. Warriors of Light. What is this old lady doing? You must seek out Doga. He is the only one who can help you defeat Zande. Seek Doga on the continent of Dalg. Fair enough. Whoa, whoa what, when, how? Where am I? We're in Amur, the city of water. Gramps found us in the temple and brought us here. We had been asleep for three straight days, and the world has changed much in that span. No one here remembers having their time stopped. It's as if it never happened. Fair enough. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay, guys, I'm going to end the episode off here. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as for the channel, and I'll see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.